governments of the world. Those holding political power in Egypt have chosen to answer the people's calls for democracy with lethal violence. International organizations must take it upon themselves to heed these calls at this turning point in history. Democratic governments cannot idly stand by. We call upon you to take action and show the world that you are on the side of the people and their fight for freedom and democracy. Your support of the popular uprisings in Arabic countries has been ambiguous, if not absent altogether. Secretary of State Hillary Clinton exemplified the indecisiveness of the international community as she claimed that the U.S. could not take sides. Neutrality amounts to complicity as totalitarian regimes are showing their contempt for the citizens' right to protest. Mubarak's regime attempted to disconnect the Egyptian people from the rest of the world by cutting off internet communication, while his foot soldiers shot civilians and assaulted domestic and international journalists. It is up to you to work for the people and support the universal right to freedom of speech. It is your prerogative to oppose violent regimes, regardless of your political affiliation. The geopolitical concerns for stability have for far too long served as an excuse to ignore the violations of human rights. People throughout the Arab world have been victimized and held hostage by their regimes. Now the people are standing up. The current situation within Egypt presents the leadership of the world with a unique opportunity to acknowledge and respect the people's ambition to control its own future. This is also the time when the question will finally be answered, once and for all, are Western governments truly, of, by, and for the people or are they merely puppet facades, designed to ensure the continued domination by those in power? Anonymous has made its choice. We will take sides. We will support people who strive for freedom of speech, assembly and communication, the civil rights essential for the people to forge their own futures. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us.